WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento with the mid-afternoon update. Uh, stocks under pressure today, following through from yesterday. Uh, not surprising because if you look at the um, NASDAQ Banking Regional Index, the KRE, I'll post that a little later, every single stock, every single one, folks, 50 of them are uh, actually, yeah, 50 of them are all down, everything in the red. I mean, that doesn't happen very much, 2.6%. Uh, but the market's bouncing back. We bounced back another 20 points. Here in the S&P, we bounced back another 150 points in the Dow. So there's buyers coming in, and as they should, because believe it or not, folks, the low today was a beautiful ABCD in the SPY down there at 4020. So there's nothing bearish about the technical picture as of yet, but... Who knows? Treasury bonds still moving to the upside. Gold, of course, is in the area of Obi-Wan Tenobi out there in the stratosphere with CP30 and R2D2. It hit yesterday, folks, 2080. It had such a beautiful, I'll go into that in the next uh, next segment here, but had such a beautiful 78% level at 2045, backed off $18 really quick and able to put a little bit of pocket change in the minds of a short-term trader. And then at the end of the day, uh, fortunately, I was not here and not involved in the market anymore, but it took off like a striped deer running through the forest with a tiger behind him. Anyway, uh, it looks like we're going up to the 2100 level uh, in gold and $27 uh, in silver. That certainly looks like uh, it's going to be moving in that direction. Uh, even Bitcoin was uh, picking up speed, and they had several people on Bloomberg today. Uh, actually, uh, Hugh Henry, who's one of the smarter dudes in the world when it comes to this kind of stuff. He's a former hedge fund dude out of uh, the UK. Uh, he said he was buying uh, Bitcoin at 25000 if given the opportunity. And he also thought that gold was going to go up. His biggest fear was the fact that these uh, blockchain cryptos will be taken over by the government. And when you try to buy something with their electronic money, they're going to say, well, you can't buy it with that. You have to buy it with something else. And then you have to give so much to charity, and they're going to know exactly where you are and exactly what you're doing at any particular time. And that's not good. 877-927-6648. We'll be right back. <laughs> 